What's up guys, my name is Section from the Deviants, and today we're going to be reacting to My Hero Academia Season 3, Episode 8. So last time on My Hero Academia, we had Deku who died. So without further ado, let's get straight on into it. Make sure to support the original content, as always. Alright, let's get going in 3, 2, 1, and... Bah. The prestigious school that's turned out some of the world's greatest heroes. And maybe villains, though I don't think they talk about that. <laughs> told me there'd always be people beyond our reach that we can't protect even though we want to which is why we have to save the people we can reach within reason within reason we have to leave this to the professionals it's thank not you the right time for us to get involved so if i stand by and do nothing now how am i supposed to call myself a hero or a man i don't think you're a hero yet you're more of like a hero in training going to get Momo to make you another receiver, track a bad guy, and then try to save Bakugo all by yourselves? Yeah. Mm. I get how frustrated Kirishima is, but we can't let our emotions get the best of us. Thank you, Hand. It doesn't matter how noble your intentions. If you go out there trying to find the bad guys, knowing you're breaking the rules... And you're acting like villains, not heroes. Thank you, Sue. Thank you, Sue, for being level-headed and smart. <laughs> Sorry for interrupting you guys, but What's I up? need a moment alone with Midoriya. Recovery Girl performed some pretty strong healing on your arms while you were unconscious, so you should be able to move them around fairly well. You mean I was hurt a lot worse this time? I took. Uh, <laughs> yeah. If you sustain this type of injury, even just two or three more times. I don't think you're going to be able to move your arms anymore. For now, focus on rehabilitation. Also, don't forget, you did save someone. Healing begins in the mind. Try not to worry. Stay positive. Please, get better soon so I can thank you in person, okay? Goda. Adorable. There's a call for you, Endeavor, sir. Who is it? Your son. Mr. Sukauchi from the police department. Okay, never mind. We would like to request your assistance, sir. I've received an emergency summons and must leave this place in your hands. Be strong as heavyweight dead and without- Ooh, they're getting the top heroes? Safe. Who's number three again? You got it. You best oh, him, right? No, that's number five. It looks sick, though. Hold on. Okay, Ida, please talk some sense, please. Why did it have to be you two of all people? The ones who stopped me when I acted recklessly. Why are you trying to make the same stupid mistakes I made? Didn't you learn? Oh my gosh, Ida, yes. Ida, we have to. No, you don't. No, you don't like us breaking rules, but... <laughs> I'm frustrated too. And concerned, obviously. Oh, <laughs> that was I'm a good. class rep, damn it. <laughs> that was great. Yeah, we'll be stealthy. I'm talking covert options. You stealthy? Breaking the rules. I don't know about that. We'll never agree. So I'm going to come with you. <sighs> We've gathered some of our finest heroes here today. Now, let's talk strategy. I swear, if these kids ruin the strategy. Will you join the League of Villains? Go throw yourself in the traffic. <laughs> Something. The coordinates indicate Kamino Ward, Yokohama City, and Kanagawa Prefecture. Our travel time will be about two hours from here. So this is Kamino Ward. It's so crowded. Those villains are hiding somewhere in this city. Yeah, what happened to stealth? We have to consider that we could be attacked at any moment. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Stealth mode. You're standing out even more, Midoriya. <laughs> oh my gosh. The fool! What you looking at? <laughs> this is me, incognito. Perfect. Now we're blending perfectly. Oh yes, that is perfect. You talking to me? <laughs> <laughs> Close enough. Close enough. Great. Everyone, our destination is this way. Whoa, you a <laughs> uh? 
Let's return to a short clip oh. from the UA High School press conference that just wrapped up. We are here to apologize. A recent incident allowed harm to come to Hey, look at Aizawa, though. Heroes. What are these dudes thinking? They're going to get those kids killed. They should be ashamed. The mood was changing. You could feel it in the air. People were turning against heroes. Mm -hmm. And if we didn't do something, it was just going to get worse. Dobby, let him go. What? You know he'll just fight. It's fine. We're recruiting him, so we should treat him as an equal. I do apologize for such forceful methods. Father. Please understand that we aren't some kind of unruly mob committing crimes without a third act in mind. I'm sure you're the same. Oh. Shigaraki! Can you not get to the point, or do you just like your own voice? Both. Both, actually. Uh... Father. Huh? Okay, well that last part gave me a huge amount of questions. First off, Shigaraki, uh, why'd you say father when you're looking at the hand? My quick judgment thought, oh, you know, he, maybe he's being controlled and the hand is like what's controlling him. But I quickly dismissed that idea because we've seen him without the hand and he's still kind of like crazy and, you know, um, especially when he was in the the mall with Midoriya and he was like about to kill Midoriya, even though he was like asking questions and stuff like that. He didn't have the, the hand mask and he was still acting pretty much the same. So I don't think it's that. But I do find it odd, like, how he just looked at the hand and just said, Father. And I'm pretty sure you guys know how I feel about this plan that Midoriya, Todoroki, and all of them have. And I unfortunately think the worst is going to happen. Actually, you know what? Not, not the worst, because the worst would be, like, they all die. But I don't think anything good is going to happen from what they are doing. I think they're further going to ruin the name of UA. Either they're going to get caught or what they're doing is going to cause some like destruction inside the city. And then they're going to be like labeled as, you know, UA students who cannot be controlled. And then people are going to be like questioning like, oh, why are they teaching these kids? These kids are out of control. You know, we can't trust the UA teachers to, you know, control these kids. I do wonder what Bakugo is going to do. I don't think he's going to be trying to like blast everyone all at once and try to escape. Though, it does seem like something Bakugo would do. And if that's the case and he somehow escapes, then Midoriya and his group are going to try to rescue Bakugo even though he's gone. Or they might catch Bakugo at the right time when Bakugo is trying to escape. I'm not sure. I do want to know what the police are talking about with all the, the major heroes. But anyways, that was my reaction to My Hero Academia Season 3 Episode 8. If you like my reaction, make sure to like and subscribe. If you guys want me to know anything more, put in the comment section down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.